You see this thing you're seeing on my screen now. You see it. Page recommendation. As a page owner, you don't need to joke with this page recommendation. Whatever that you know that you will do for your page to be recommendable, I beg, do them. Because if this page, if your page is not recommendable, you're not, you're going nowhere. That your page is moving, that you're seeing uh, views, you're seeing reaction, you're seeing share, you're seeing comments on your Facebook page is because your page is recommendable. If your page is not recommendable, or um, more, hmm, it's better that you go and open a new page and start building that one. Not that you leave your old one, you will also be posting there, but start building a fresh one. Because when your page is not recommendable, one, Facebook will not be recommending your page to people. You know the name now, page recommendation. It means that your page will be recommending to people, but once it's no longer recommendable, people will not be seeing your post you will post now to see reaction now wahala to see comments now wahala to see share now wahala to see view now wahala so have you seen it so whatever that you know that you will do for your page to be recommendable i beg they do them on your page anything that you know that will make your page recommendation to be flagged avoid it at times you might be posting your own video and they will also flag it once you see any flag video on your page recommendation go and delete it immediately very very important very very important because if the thing continues to pile there it will yeah it will cause another thing to your page so always make sure that you try your best to make your page to be recommendable so that people can see your post when you make a post if your page is not recommendable, people will scroll very long before they will be able to see your post. You can see now, maybe it's not everybody that normally comes to Facebook. Some will come to Facebook before 10 minutes, 20 minutes, they are off from Facebook. The ones they see, they will watch. So if your page is not recommendable, it will not be the among the ones that that person that comes to Facebook will see. You understand? So that's why it's important. As a page owner, make sure that you try your best to make your page recommendation to be recommendable. So that your page will be moving. Even if you're not getting enough engagement on your page for now. But at least, as far as it's recommendable, it will be going. At least you'll be seeing small, small reactions, small, small like views. And till the day algorithm will locate you and your the video will go viral or your post will go viral okay so guys i said let me ship in this thing so that we will know how to continue to keep our page to be recommendable very very important okay like a video i dropped uh, two days ago about how i was able to resolve my growth page uh, growth at risk it was from page recommendation had it been that it's not a uh, resolve I don't know what would have happened to my page by now. So it's very important as a content creator, make sure that if in the morning before you make any post, go and check your page recommendation, your support inbox, and your page quality before you make any post. And anytime you want to make any post, make sure that you go and check it. And here you make a post. After, after like 30 minutes, go and check it again. Very, very important. Okay? So that if you have any flag video, you can rectify it immediately. That one that happened to my page, I didn't mean that I didn't uh, see it um, early. I don't know what could have happened to my page by now. So it's very important. Always check your page recommendation, your support inbox, your page quality, and make sure that you post things that will not go against community standards so that your page will continue to be recommendable. Thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to share this video. Like and comment. I love you all. Bye. See you on my next video.